Alright, this is the Critch Tram Car Museum, Derbyshire. I think it's basically a little miniature town with uh, tram cars. I don't know if this one's going to come up this way, it would be too much of a, a lucky thing. I wasn't quite sure what to expect. There's a massive exhibition hall which I'll show you in a second. Um, and you can ride on the trams. Which, uh, isn't it funny? I used to pay peanuts for this. It costs £19 today to come in as an adult. Wilson Green Station, number 40. Exhibition hall, and then you have the tram sheds, and weirdly, you've got a German one here, and Falkenberg. Sure, that rings a bell from Berlin, but I could be talking rubbish there, couldn't I? <laughs> Smells oily. <laughs> This one must be uh, being renovated. Yeah. Long way to go. It's a Blackpool tram. Infante. Is that French? Show my. Oh no. De Porto. It's almost a shame they're inside because you can't actually see them properly. <laughs> right, there's quite a few back there. Basically, if you're into your trams, this is definitely a place to visit because they all look pretty good. Lead City Transport. I'll have a quick look on the uh, other side of this one. Do you love your trains? I mean, this is heaven, isn't it? <laughs> What's that? Lime Street, Scotland Road. What have we got here? That oh, looks like an old one, doesn't it? Chesterfield. What is it? Here is it? Withdrawn in 1927. This is a Blackpool, built in 1934, Blackpool 249. Now, I don't know how good the camera will be inside, but you can have a look inside. <laughs> Top deck is closed. I 
it's interesting, the seats can be um, brought forward and backwards, so they face in a different direction. That's funny. <laughs> so it feels it's all wood. Right, I'm six foot, just over six foot, and my head doesn't touch the ceiling, which is handy. See the driver. The driver doesn't have a lot of room, does he? I say he because I'm pretty sure in those days it was mostly he's. <laughs> Didn't realise it went to an age um, system in here. So a Porto 9 built in 1873. Then we start moving 1860s. Bright side. I can't see where that one's from. Step back. You may have seen me rise the camera slightly there, that's because the kid walked past. So, these are horse drawn ones by the look of it. Because 1870s, the age of the horse. No smoking inside, no dogs in or on. Oh no, I've misread that. No smoking allowed inside the car, no dogs allowed in or on the car. To carry 16 passengers inside and 18 outside. Oh, the seats are sideways. <laughs> Heading Lee. Is that Leeds? Yep. Great, aren't they? I'm not sure what this is. This is very old or very decayed. Let's have a look. Ease Peyton reversible tram, horse tram, 1877. It looks like a fire truck, doesn't it? There's a bed on it, so it is uh, linked to fire brigade, I presume. I stopped at the uh, horse. This is a big one. Looks like a steam. Oh, it is a steam engine. I'll have to show the miniature one in a second. So it was a new van, 1890s. More of a bus. Stands out a little bit here because these are all trams. So, 1920s, 30s, 40s, which is why the music is playing. Up to this one, the big double decker, which is, I think, says 1960s on it. Glasgow. Oh, it's a good one. What's this one? Douglas Southern Electric Tramway. So, double decker. 1896. 1939 builder in Loughborough. You can see it's just like uh, open sided. Right, I see all clear. Right, so tram's going to come down to collect passengers shortly. Good old fashioned police. Cool box or TARDIS. And then Town Hall. So that one's departing. This is the uh, alighting point, but here comes the, ne the next one. Or at least uh, finishing its journey. I'm trying not to get the people in, but I can't really help here. You know. It's weird seeing those running. If you're 
out walking uh, in England, there's always uh, signposts. Um, this is not the most helpful because it could be this way or it could be that way or it could be the other way. I'm not sure if this is just a maze. No, it's not. I'm just looking at it quickly. It's a bit of sculpture. What does this say? There would be more. Sculpture trail. There's a wizard. There's lots of wood sculptures here. Some treasure. And Excalibur. There's a. Where that blue is, there's a wood sculptor based. Next Gulliver, and there's more to come. I love this bridge. It's got its own troll.